Hi, welcome to this demonstration of IoT based smart energy grid system. Now this is a very innovative concept wherein the authorities can on the online website on IoT Gecko uh, can actually see whatever is happening on the on site things like uh, how much energy is being consumed by the user and uh, if any energy grid is down then another grid can be switched on, on automatically so that will also be shown on the IoT Gecko interface and also if there is energy theft offering that will also be displayed on the website and the authorities can therefore take uh, whatever actions necessary so let us see what is what are things are included um, you can see this is the energy meter uh, this is used for uh, monitoring how much energy is being consumed by the user these are the current sensors they are actually used for detecting theft then this is a powerful relay that is uh, used for switching between the two utility grids that is grid 1 and grid 2 the this is at mega 328 microcontroller this will be used for processing everything uh, including the theft and uh, switching between the utility grids and as well as communicating over wi-fi that uh, using the wi-fi module to the internet uh, also these bulbs are used uh, for demonstrating as loads so let us see how the project works As soon as the project is turned on, it will try to connect to the Wi-Fi. The user, user should give a proper uh, hotspot connections to the project so that it connects to the Wi-Fi uh, to internet. Also on the IoT Gecko interface, uh, the person sh should uh, uh, insert the proper number like uh, per price per unit. So suppose we insert S10. So the price per unit will be 10, that means every increment of 1 unit, the consumer will be charged as 10. So now we can see that uh, online the smart energy grid is turned on here on the website and energy consumption is 0 as per now and cost is also 0. So now let us start the utility grid. As soon as it gets turned on, you can see that uh, it starts monitoring the energy consumption and also updating it on the website. Now energy consumption has increased over here and uh, also it is detecting it is not detecting any theft so it's showing as no, no theft Now you can see that uh, it has updated on the website that energy grid 2 was uh, active and also the energy consumption and also the rate has been updated on the website. This all things are real time that means uh, everything gets updated instantaneously as soon as an update is uh, seen over in the system. So now let us try uh, to explore the features of this. Uh, let us now try to turn the other grid on. Now we have turned the other grid on so you can see that as energy grid 2 was highlighted now energy grid, grid 1 has been highlighted that means uh, energy grid 1 is now active. So this feature helps the authorities to give uninterrupted supply to the user using uh, one spare utility grid. Now let us check the uh, theft feature that whenever a theft is occur occurring it will also uh, notify to the authorities on the website. So let us simulate the theft feature. As soon as the theft was uh, occurring over there, 
it notified to the authorities that energy theft has occurred this was the external theft that occurred uh, which means that someone has been tapping energy from the uh, from the lines that has been coming to your uh, residential lines also let us now try to simulate the other th type of theft that means the theft which is which occurs uh, internally from a household that means if a household is trying to uh, take energy from without letting the authorities know about it so again you can see that energy theft has been detected over here so in this way the authorities have can have a full view monitoring of the energy consumption and of the utility grids and also of the theft being occurred at uh, the site of the user and thus have a full control of uh, what is uh, happening on the user side and take charge of it so this is how the project works thank you